Hello everyone! This is much here from Slackers Undercover, bringing you an old time radio show. Actually, no, I am bringing you Evoland! Evoland is a journey through the history of action adventure gaming, allowing you to unlock new technologies, gameplay systems, and graphical upgrades as you progress through the game! Essentially, taking it from old school days all the way up to a more modern touch. Inspired by many cult series that have left their mark in the RPG video gaming, Culture Evil Land takes you through a wonderful world diversity and evolution. Let's get into it! If I'll get into the screen. New game! You got the right key. Seems to be some chest open this way. Oh. Oh, it's already, it's already start. Oh. I can't go left, I can just go right. Okay. We got the left key. Always going right is boring. Oh, I, I can go... Oh, they're not keys. They're actually letting me keys left and right. Oh my gosh. You got T 2D movement. That's good. You can't go anywhere else anyway. Well, good. We can go two-dimensional now. There's no music. Of course, to be fair, I guess some of the early games didn't really have music. They're my basic Game Boy games. You got basic scrolling. You want to see where you're heading, right? We can go. Oh, oh, it's like the original, original Zelda. You got Sounds FX. The game is much more alive this way. I have footsteps. I'm not just floating around like a ghost. You got smoother scrolling. We'll save you some headache. Oh, nice. Yeah. We're not going from screen to screen. We're, we're evolving pretty fast here. When do I get background music? And also, anyone else got like the, the weird liney thing in the background there? You got a sword! Now you can kill the evil monsters and cut down bushes. How does one? Oh, space bar does the sword thing. Alright, alright. Let's go find some bushes. Not to be confused with ex-presidential bushes. We have no reason to sword them. But these bushes... Take that for being wild and free, bush! You got monsters. Be careful not to touch them. Oh, are those little, like, little octopuses from, uh, Zelda? Oh, they sound sad. Well, they sound sad when you kill them. Music! Evil Land Toon topping the charts since 2012. It's not something we have yet. Oh, save points. Evolution that changed gaming forever. Yeah, I, I remember... I remember earlier games that didn't have save points, so... Uh, granted, that's me going, like, I'm old, and I'm from a gaming era of passcodes and things of that nature, but... You know, the, my, the first game I ever played that had saving was Legend of Zelda for NES. Followed by a... Well, no, it wasn't Metroid. I think it was just was Legend of Zelda. That was the first save game I ever played. A star! Collect all the hidden stars of Evil Land. Oh, there's probably a lot of stars. Many stars. So we got the card bat card to play double twin. Oh, there's a card game. Also, that that sound effect. Oh. Okay. There's no no main menu to alter my sound settings yet. That's probably something I gotta evolve into having. Come here, little box. Ooh, 16 color display. Ain't that pretty? We just turned in from uh, Game Boy to Game Boy Color. I'm moving up in the world. Go ahead and throw me another save down. Oh, yeah, yeah. You've been here, right? See, we have been here. See means yes. And we means yes. I don't... I, I'm afraid to get hit because if it's anything like an old school game, we're currently at... 
take one hit, you die, philosophy. So let's not take a hit if we can help it. I don't want to go back to my save point. Well, that save point. Ooh, we got story. Evil Land, a short story of adventure, video games evolution. After years, after after years, after centuries of peace and ancient evil has finally resurfaced to threaten the world of Evil Landia. You are one of the few remaining members of the Order of the Dragon Knights whose purpose is to travel the world to help the needy and fight evil. Those centuries of peace clearly mean you haven't had a whole lot to do recently, but it looks like business is picking up again. You got storyline. The plot is so deep and rich and wide and deep. And, 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 and deeper. I... Yeah. Yeah. But Thank you. Ooh, we got upgraded already. 256 color display. Ooh, that is pretty, and I don't... Maybe it's the f game just being full screen that's causing that issue. I don't know what to tell you. Sign panel. Luckily, it seems your hero knows how to read these signs. I deserve for the Agile Adventures. I can't go through that. Oh, please don't... Please don't touch me. I do not like to be touched by large bats. Not a song. Baby got bat. <laughs> no. The access has been blocked by the dimensional stone. Try the path. The dimension. It doesn't look very dimensional. It looks like a stone. What's so dimensional about it? You got free movement. It looks like it's time for some action adventure. Oh, I can actually go like uh, diag di di diagonally. Diagonally now. Oh, no! Press action to return to title screen. <laughs> I was right. I was 100% right. We didn't have a life bar yet, so we died in one hit. Welcome to the old style games, folks. Okay, we'll continue. I gotta hit the stowaway again. Not gonna read it. And do high speed. Caught up. Please do not kill me this time. I beg of you. This, this isn't I wanna be the guy, Gaiden. Gaiden? 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 I don't know. Sign panel. We've read that sign. We know what it says. We disregard it. There we go, free movement. I can go sideways and back and forth and kill the bat. Don't, don't, don't hit me, bat, please. I think you got, I think you got free movement too. That's why you scare me now. Oh, I can go through here now. Oh, because I'm not locked on a, uh, a, a, a square path. I can kind of go right. Wink. Oh, thank you, save point. Ooh. Oh, we got Stalfos just like, well, just like Zelda, honestly. An inventory. Oh, ba oh, she's got a sword. I'm gonna stab you anyway. I don't need to. Ooh. Can, can we not? Hey, a path unlocked. Killing the monsters sometimes helps you in your quest. Go figure, it's like a game or something. Kinda wanna go back and double check and make sure we're not missing out on anything. I remember there was a box further back. Yeah, I don't know. Oh wait, yeah, there's, there's a box right here. What'd I mix? Miss. I got a star, okay. Miss out on a star, no big deal. Have to come back and get all of the stars later. Probably come back later when we get like mini mini evolutions further. Where we can see everything that there is to see and get everything that there is to offer. You got an overworld! Exploring the world is always nice, but beware of ran oh man, we got random encounters. That's a bad thing when in a game that we don't have uh, HP. 
We got a turn-based battle system. Let's change to a different fighting style. We get we get to change from. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> it's it's old school Final Fantasy style. Okay, well to be fair, a lot of games had the style of RPG turn-based battling back in the day. It's just this is very. Final Fantasy, because I, I swear that that chicken thing we fought with the saddle was supposed to be reference to a chocobo. Also, let, let's be honest, Gliss, a hundred Gliss, and Gills. It's the same button, that the same name is just slightly different. Oh, I, I need to find a place to heal up soon. Also, I don't have a name, apparently. Fifty Gliss! Mode 7, oh yeah! The really gorgeous one introduced back in 1990. Oh, I remember this well. This was back when your top-down games had some depth to it, and you're like, wow. I'm actually traveling the world. Die old, yes. 50 Gliss. Oh, we're back into a 3D ring. Oh, uh, you've got places name. You will learn the name of the places you travel to. You know, not for nothing, I guess that's something that you kind of take for granted in this day and age. So usually you walk into places and it's like, you're in. You're in. You've just entered. E Knox Canyon or something, and you're like, oh, okay. Well, good for me, I'm here in this canyon. Oh yeah. I'm gonna kill all you guys, because I imagine it's gonna give me a chest. Just like Zelda. You are weak from the sides. Yay! Easy peasy fun burrito. You got chest unlocked. Killing all the monsters will cause. We can unlock treasures. A village? What do villages always have such annoying music? <laughs> oh, ain't that the truth? It's a village or a vlogi for those of you out of town. Can't open this. That door doesn't exist. That door also doesn't exist, but there's a chest here. You got enter houses, now you can freely invade people's privacy. Oh, can I smash their pots? That's all I want to do is just smash people's pots. Can't read the note. Can't go in this bed. Oh. Mind Fight by A. Zephyros. Doesn't look like a very fun read. Just things like it. How to Save the World with Heroes Crystal by H. Sakaguchi. I don't think I'll need this. You know what? Take it as you may. I want to read all the infos. You found a potion! Oh, baby. You got Innkeeper. A nice bed is waiting for you. At a decent price. The Legend of Kefka's Ghost by Village People. Local tales, I guess. Oh, Kefka. You crazy animal. You look tired. What about resting in our cozy inn? It'll only cost you ten gills. I said gills. Yes. Save the game. I am pretty sure the night passed. As the lights faded out, I am um, into a house. I go. Hello, friendly neighborhood adventurer. All your chests are belong to us. Lost translation. Hey, how to cook an emuk? A KFC yummy. Ha. <laughs> oh, is it gonna be like an item seller? You got shopkeeper. You can always spend your gliss with this guy. Also, speaking of gliss, 
I found gloves. Yo, give, give me all your loots. Sorry, the National Sword Association does not allow us to sell weapons to children yet. I must find a chest that allows me to do so. Who do I seek about letting me buy a weapon as a child? Actually, to be fair, in, in, in adventure fantasy settings like this, wouldn't you want your children to have weapons? Because, I mean, let's be honest, monsters are outside all the time. You might want them to be able to defend themselves. Oh, this door is locked. Maybe there's something in there. Probably. Is there something in there? Oh, there is, actually. Yeah, let's, uh, let's hold off on that yet. Get an NPC, at last, someone to talk to. Not. Sorry, I don't speak to children. Jeez. Come on, cheese and crackers. A new card, the Torque. The medium is the message. Oh, wait, the medium is the massage by McLaurin. Very fitting. The Ultimate Guide to Everything by S. Miyamoto. What a genius. Uh, that's not a reference. Well, that is a reference to Shigeru Miyamoto. Who is the founding father of a lot of things. He's uh, one of the big wigs in Nintendo. Hey, potion. I can't sneak over here. There's something in your... There's gotta be something in the fireplace. And he wasn't joking. This town music is lame. Stop bothering me. Go play with other children. Oh my gosh. You're mean. Absolutely despicable. Mm, let's go to that well. Oh, wait. Hello. Okay. Let's go to the well. Before I'm going to stab somebody over not saying hello back to me. I mean, at least say, hello, how are you, little child? I don't talk to kids. Okay, fair enough. What are you doing here, children? You should go to... You are a tool. If you're not a nice boy, the evil Kefka's ghost will come and eat you. Well, that's just a storybook. We've been told that. Yeah. Yes, sure. You got secret place. What the hell are you doing in this place? Well, I gotta get the mana nut from Secret of Mana, and then I'm gonna rain tear on, on everything. You found a strange seed. Do you want? Oh, eat it. Oh, no. Oh, that's the man. Yeah, okay, let's eat it. It it made me an adult. You got grow taller. What's with all the kids in video games, anyways? So. I'm pretty sure this was supposed to be a reference to the, to the mana seed in Secret of Mana, which you put your sword to, it awakens something in the sword, and that's kind of the, the, the story, the, the premise of the game is, we got a, a card worm. The fact that it's like, do you want to eat the seed? Is kind of funny, because had it happened in the original game, <laughs> that would have been great. Like, oh, well, you eat it, ate the seed, uh, 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 what do we do now? <laughs> Poop on the sword? No. Uh, I heard a lot of... Now you want to talk to me. Hi! I heard a lot of strange sounds coming out of the North Caves. Did you hear strange sounds coming out of the well? I was but a child. Now I'm a man. It's a Tom Hanks movie. A girl's visit us earlier. Is she a friend of yours? Mm. Was she in a chest? The crystal caves to the north are a dangerous place. Said the Kefka's ghost lives there. No adventure has ever come back to tell us. So how do you know? Like, yeah, buddy. Kefka's ghost lives there, or so we think. But no one said anything, because they're dead. Oh, we can't buy items from children. I mean, we can't, we can't buy them. We can't sell them. Hey, buddy. Can I shine your head? Alright, welcome to the Papa 
Nukia Village, please enjoy your stay with us. Hope I hit mute, because I coughed loud. Papa Nuka Village, so you couldn't even tell a child what village he was in. What is your problem, man? Welcome to the adventure shop. Please spend all your money here. Thank you. Yeah, that sounds about right. Long sound. Yo, oh, 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 oh. Rare card. Mm, soon. Phoenix down. We know that brings you back to the lab. Let's get some armor. Yo, the fence has increased. Actually, I can't see what I can't, I can't see what uh sword I got right now. I'd imagine I probably have the sword that they have. Maybe not. Maybe so. Do I have enough for the sword? Should I buy the sword? Yeah, let's go ahead. Oh, excuse me. I didn't buy that. I did buy that. Well, I'm dumb. Yep. Yep. That's a sword. Totally, that's a sword. It's in a bottle and everything. Adults are not funny. They always complain about us children. If only I could eat this growth seed, I would no longer be a child. The seed I found has fallen down the well. I'm too scared to get it back. It's too dark down there. Well, I'm scared that there's such things as growth seeds that make children grow into adults. That's kind of a weird economy. Also, hold up. This inn, I just realized, this inn is... The city, this village, is a place that does not talk to children. However, the sin keeper had no issues taking my money as a small child and letting me stay in a hotel room by myself. And, and let me rephrase that. Not even staying in a hotel room by myself. Sleeping in an open room like this by myself as a small child. Lady. I... What? What do? Right. We've got crystal caves to the north we gotta head to. Apparently there's someone who may or may not be an ally to us. There are quite strong monsters in the caves ahead. We won't let you pass without with your current equipment. Like, for real? Alright then, I think I... I have been in here, right? I have been in here. Okay, so apparently I do need to buy an iron sword. So I'm gonna have to go outside and fight a few times to get the means to do that. I am big man now, look at me. Random encounter. Oh! It kinda looks like I'm using a sword, but it could be a dagger or something. Like that. Yeah, yeah, actually it doesn't say I have an item at all right now, just potion and copper armor or something. Alright, fine. Kill more of these little birdies! The adorable righty birds that have saddles on them, so clearly they're someone's pets. Or friends. I know we have enough. I'm gonna grab just one more battle. That way I can get a sword and a potion at the same time. We got slams. Oh, it didn't be a long battle. I don't have specials. Special I got is the special, the number five. Order of pain with fries. With cheese. Okay, that's way more gil gliss than I need. Item store, come here, give me what I seek. Longsword. You bought the item longsword, your tax increased. Ready to fight stronger monsters. Look that. I'll fight all the monsters you want to bring to me. Man, we, we've been in this game like a whole... Actually, I 
How long have we been in this game? We've been in this game a whole 25 minutes, and we're essentially we're at Secret of Mana levels of technology, which is uh, I want to say 1993 ish, 1990 Super Nintendo. So yeah, we're we're moving, it, we're picking up, picking it up, and putting it down the road. You got forced fights. Someone is calling for help. Skaven <laughs> with a V and their little mole rats. That is a reference to V Skaven from uh, in that in that Warhammer 40k. I heard someone calling for help. Looks like she got attacked by these monsters. Time to stab them in the face. Totally forgot to buy a potion earlier too, didn't I? Thank you for saving me from those monsters. I need the crystal in the cave to save my hometown. Will you help me? I can't say no. I haven't been given that option yet, yes. By the way, my name is... You got forced choice. Looks like the snare is lacking proper branching. <laughs> Can I erase it? Let's name her... Carrie. Because it's easier than whatever the heck that was. Kyrus. Kyrie. Kyro. Kyrie. <laughs> you know what would be nice? The ability to run. If you're what am I doing? What? What are you doing? Run over to this inn real quick and do two very important things. One, I need to heal up. Because I'm close to death, she's close to death. Also, I haven't saved in a while. And after that first death and getting reverted back to save points, this game doesn't have checkpoints. It is very much old school in that sense. Right now. So let's uh let's not have wasted time and have to repeat things. I am gonna take what little money I have and do two things. Um Okay, so I can't buy more armor. Okay. Many potions have been bought. Ready to rock and roll? Yeah, let's rock and roll. Let's do this. What is this on your head? That's a helmet. It's a visor to a helmet, I just realized, but you're not wearing a helmet. So why are you wearing a visor? That's the weirdest statement. That, this is the weirdest look ever. That's like chopping the brim off of a hat and then just wearing that around. Oh, wait, they already have that. That's, uh, that's a poke, one of those poker hats. Golf hats. I forget what they're called. You know what I mean. The Crystal Gabes. And she floated outside of me. We need to find the crystal. Its power can change your perception of the world. And with it, you can fight the evil that threatens my village. That I've been signed up to do for some reason. By the way, I just noticed that I forgot to ask you your name. His name is Clink. You know, let, let, let's go old, 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 old screw. Old screw here. Old school. His name will be Hero. Hero. Actually, no, screw. Let, let's, let's go full meme here. Hello, you stinky hero. You got a name! The girl's fantasy knows seeing you're an actual human being. Lies. Absolute total lies. You got cave monsters. Oh, looks like the cave is inhabited. 
Bye, yo. Let me guess, you're gonna hit like a wet noodle. Yeah. Ah, you, you partner characters in every RPG ever. Always just hit like wet noodles, I swear. So you get your main guy, he's like, he's strong, he's your main character, he's awesome. And you get the second guy, and they're just like, I'm a magic user. I slap people with paper. Okay, we got no map. That's not introduced that Cobra Zero. Oh, he kind of, oh, he kind of uh, rough. We're not getting experience or anything. I just noticed that potion. Wait. Oh, I smacked him. So really there's no reason to hang around for too long because, you know, we're not getting... We're not getting experience. We're just finding a couple items here and there, which I'll probably heal up in a couple battles. Twenty bucks. Which everything we've gotten so far is just put to shame. Cobra Zero. Oh boy. Ah, uh, double boy. Had a baby. It's a boy. Please kill the snake. I beg you. Who has magic? You have back. That's not a magic. You know, you have heal, but... I mean, let's be honest here. We... I can't use potion out of combat? Are you... Are you, are you thunking serious? Are you snarious? Potion heals for everyone. Please. Chest. You got experience, boys! You can now get XP in new levels while fighting. Yes! Perfect. Feel like I'm not wasting my time. Shot him, let's do that. Ow, we you hit me for a truck ton. Night XP! Hidden Low has reached level 2 and his attack has increased. Carry our purely defensive characters. Not being boring. And just getting hit. Again, you guys can't hit the broad side of a barn. Come on, guys, put your backs into it. Oh, I'm happy you one shot him, but he didn't took so many attempts. There we go. Hey, a star. So there's nothing on the other side, just that. The question is, do we need to level up? And being that we just got the ability to get experience, it probably wouldn't hurt to get a couple levels. Defense up, and her magic has increased. I wonder if we get to like level 4 or something before we... We got life fountain. First water might heal your wounds. Yeah, you'll have to wait till next time! Oh, I can save my game here too. Awesome. Yeah, let's get uh, some easy... Easy outs here. Or, you know... 
some easy outs if we stop running to Cobra Zero over here. There's a switch there and it scares me. Cad the Skaven. A little mouse friend. Okay, let's get a step on it. We got something happened somewhere, but where? Probably up top. It's the only place we have gone yet. Oh, this is a torque. We got your card, Mr. Torque. Yeah, that, that screams boss territory to me. Yes. 5 XP. Hang around our Healy Fountain right here. Why? Uh, it, it, this, this weird graphical thing is messing with me, man. Why is it... Why is he doing that? I'll... Yeah... Mm. To the next save point, I'll, uh... Shoot, I, when we level up, I'll, I'll save and exit. And, uh, see if I can just get a, uh... we level up? Our life is increased, and our, 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 our boy Elroy got something else. Okay, game saved. Turn to my menu, options. I, I can't. I can't. I can't do nothing with that. Can I alt enter? Did I hit new game? Here's what we're gonna do. I didn't save it. Nothing was saved. It's all good here. We're good here. We're everything is good here. Let's just go back to Evil Land, open it back up. Nothing was saved. Let's just hit Alt Enter right now. That way I can get a window and not. See, it's, it's, it's a little tiny for you guys. Don't mind it. We'll just, uh. What you gonna do right here? Yeah, see, we're back over here. Everything's good. Now, do I have all the weird, freaky, uh, issues again? It doesn't look like I do, so. Let's just uh, increase it from here, and then that should fix the dealio, right? No more weird issues. Now, I, of course, I gotta play on a tiny little screen, but if it fixes the weird issues for you guys, so be it. I don't mind. It actually does look a lot better, so... <laughs> I don't think the game is supposed to be full screen, but I don't think it's supposed to have that issue. Okay, we are full HP'd up. Let me just move this slightly. Is that the crystal that she was talking about? It's gotta be. You woke up the guardian of the crystal. Oh, that is Kepka's ghost. Ha <laughs> ha! Hidden low. This one looks powerful. And law, you stinky ghost. He was the Christmas Guardian for many centuries, but it looks like it's been corrupted by some evil power. Looks like the same evil power that's attacked my hometown. You are a one trick pony there, Carrie. Get the crystal. Which means beat this guy senseless. I don't need to. That's just, just, let's just smack you. You got boss Anim. He looks. Oh, animation. He looks much more dangerous now. Yeah, he, he's like, like, oh, wiggling and jiggling and stuff. Oh, he actually kind of hurts. Phantom counter. Oh. Yep, 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 yep. That was the thing I should have done. 
Oh wow, your heal is horrible, my friend. But, you know, your damage is pretty bad too, so... i just have you do heal it, heal it on the back side. From last time, you counter me when I do that. Attack you when you're blue. Bada deep. Bada ba. 140 bliss and 20 XP. The crystal power has been activated. Do we get superpowers? Oh gosh, what what has happened? We got 3D mode. You got a whole third dimension. It's We've gone Final Fantasy VII. The power of the crystal is incredible. I can feel like I can fight the evil which threatens my village. But I have to cross the Noria Mines in order to reach it. Thank you for helping me. You're my hero. You know, that was almost my name. I, you know, it's almost called Hero. Until my player got a weird bug up his butt. Oh no, the, the, the world has gone very weird. Okay, so I gotta go to the spotlight. Okay, fine. Stabby, stabby, stabby. Looks like we have a new 3D world to explore. But that will have to wait until next time. Thank everyone for joining me. Thanks for hanging out. For more news and information on what's going on and what may be, check out the description below. If you like what you saw, want to see more like it, slap the like button, bash the subscribe button, and share the video. This is Dust Money Adventures signing off for now. Until next time, later on the ground.